This is a memorial stone I've done for John Sadler, the Ottawa School of Art. A teacher there for 41 years, a teacher and mentor to many. He was a wonderful man, a very gentle man, very spiritual man. I was lucky enough to call John a friend and a mentor. John loved my textures. He loved the flowing lines that I put in stone. So when I was asked to do this memorial stone for him, that is what I put into this stone. Textures and flowing lines. This stone will be set into the wall, so it's a bas relief. The flowing lines speak to John's gentleness, his spirituality. There's honeycombs in this stone, and the honeycombs represent his two, two children whom he dearly loved, two girls whom he just adored and was very, very proud of. And they were honeycombed into his life. This is a close-up of the honeycomb and some of the lines. It's 36 inches high. As you can see here, I have put my name in the side in full with the year, which is a little rare for me. Normally, I just put my initials. John was a wonderful, wonderful teacher. He allowed you free reign. He gave you advice, and he stood back and let you develop your own style. And when you had, he was very proud. And he used to say to me, I'd recognize your stones anywhere. As a matter of fact, when he came to visit me in the UK, I wasn't there, I was studying in Italy. And John wrote a critique of every one of my stones that he could find around the house. Just very, a very giving person. So John, this stone is for you. Thank you.